understanding it, but I'm really bad at speaking it. So I'll, I'll just say cachifo. Right? Yeah, 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 I, I was born here too. So it's yeah, just, you know how it is. Yeah, yeah, really yeah, yeah, yeah. I know it because we're Western influence. Yeah. Influence. Yeah. yeah, they have these little nicknames and they give us, you know, they talk about us in the in their language and say, look at this one. This one. I got that. I got that. Uh huh. And they go, uh huh. I got that. I hate it because I'm like, you know, I'm born here because you brought me here, right? Like this is you're doing. If I was born in Nigeria, then I would have been speaking the language. So yeah. I love that's good. that. Yeah, that's I love good. That. Okay, can you please say your name three times fast? Okay. Um, the whole thing? The whole thing. Okay. Akbar Oluwa Kemi Iruwa Bajabi Amila. Akbar Oluwa Kemi Iruwa Bajabi Amila. Akbar Oluwa Kemi Iruwa Bajabi Amila. Now, can you repeat it that fast? I will never I will never embarrass you that way. <laughs> no, it's a Yoruba name. You can say it. Say it one more time. Akbar Oluwa Kemi Iruwa Bajabi Amila. Can I be honest though? Yeah. Here's a story behind that. So when I was growing up, right. they just called me Kemi, which is short for Oluwa Kemi. Okay, okay. And so when I got my first job at 16 years old at the uh, swimming pool, local swimming pool. we worked so hard. Yeah, we worked so hard. Yeah, we worked so hard. I got my social security card and I was like, mama, who is this? And I was like, I don't even know how to say that. It was so long. It was just like, I'm like, went on to the second line. Yeah. yeah. So you yeah. didn't even know? I didn't know. They just called me Cammy. I didn't know my full name until I was 16 years old, what my full middle name was. Stop that. Yeah. That is hilarious. Yeah, and I learned how to spell my last name in the second grade. Wow. You have a story. I'm smart. <laughs> Everyone has a story. Yeah, yeah. So American Ninja Warrior. Yes, American Ninja Warrior. It is a fun competition show on NBC. Uh, you know, you get to see a lot of people from different backgrounds right. compete on these obstacles. Uh, this course is challenging, but it inspires the people who are young, who are old, who are professional athletes, who are your everyday people who are watching the show. Yeah, and they just they come out there and they are. They are pushed to for excellence because not everybody has the opportunity to perform in front of millions and millions of people. So American Ninja Warrior, it's a it's a big show. Are you super hard on them because you're an ex NFL player and you have more of the you know you've worked That's hard? A great question. That's a great question. I'm not on hard on them. I empathize with them, and I have that empathy because I know what it's like to train for something. I know what it's like to want that shine, you know, because everybody gets their time to shine, um, and but it takes time. And so for some people, it happens for them early. For others, it happens for them later. And American Ninja Warrior gives them that platform to actually go out there and do it. So, like, what are the people's most of their fears? Like, do they come on and, like, I don't think I can do this because of X, Y, and Z? Like, what did you hear the most? Well, I think a lot of people's fears comes from the illusion of seeing others fail and thinking and putting that and projecting that onto themselves right, like right, oh well I may not be able to do it because such and such failed right, so right. or they'll see some big name athlete come out there that or a competitor that's come out there and they see them fail and they go oh wow maybe I won't be able to do it so it is intimidating when we look out there I've gone out there and I've tried some of them and I can tell you like even stepping up to the very first obstacle the quintuple step you get out there you go oh, man, that's a big space between how am I gonna leap it's from side to side to side and I'm six six so for me to leap from side to side should be easy but it's intimidating it plays the mind trick on you right 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 yeah. would you equate this to like fear factor do you remember how scary that no, was no 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 this is it's a different type of fear okay it's the it's the inside it's I think all Ultimately, every human being wants to know, are they good enough? And it challenges that. It puts that to the test. Am I good enough? Can I really do this? Do I have the athletic ability to accomplish it? I love yeah. it. Okay, so one question okay. you got to pick out of these. They kind of flipped them around a little bit. Okay. I don't want you to read it. Okay, so pick a question. <laughs> No, it might be the lucky one. See? Oh, Let's I got see. two. You did? I can answer two because I have big you hands. You can. See, look, I have big hands. The 6-6 so six, six life. You're right. Yeah. You're right. Okay. The 6-6 six, six life. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Hmm. Favorite Instagram to stalk? Yep. Who's your favorite person? I'm going to tell you. I'm going to be honest. It's Usher. Because Usher is, Usher is, he's comedic. I mean, I mean, even last night he had some pictures of him at the house and he was perpetrating like he was preparing some food for the kids, <laughs> but he really got Chinese food out. He went out and got Chinese food out. So I was just like, oh man, but he keeps it real. Guy as cool as Usher, you know, he doesn't, he doesn't Instagram just the cool things that he does. Yeah. He also shows more of the real life. Right, so you right, get right. like, he's just an average and ordinary guy. Right, he's not, right. you know, he's not what everybody else perceives him to be. So I like following Usher. Like That's a good Instagram one to follow. I like that. Yeah, okay, yeah. Okay. Uh, sure, we on you. We got you. Yeah, okay. okay. And what's the next one? All right. I have big hands, so that's why I have two. Okay. <laughs> Biggest misconception about you. Or the word celebrity. Or the word celebrity that I'll go for celebrity. Okay. The biggest misconception about celebrity is that every celebrity wants to be celebrated. 
some people enjoy the private life and would rather just kind of sit behind and not necessarily put themselves just because they're an art that's their art doesn't necessarily makes them the one to have to go out there and do all the public events and so on and so forth it's a part of the job requirement but doesn't necessarily mean that that's who that person is intrinsically Absolutely. Yeah. I love that you guys heard it from him himself yes. the man of the hour he's Can Nigerian so I can't I won't I know I'm scared okay, I don't want to we'll do it, it. I, okay. I hope you okay. Akbar. Akbar. Oluwakemi Oluwakemi Idowu Idowu Baja Biamilo Baja Biamilo Alright, so that's A-K-B-A-R-O-L-U-W-A-K-E-M-I-I-D-O-W-U-G-B-A-J-A-B-I-A-M-I-L-A I, I'm gonna go back to college on that one because I can't get it. I'm, I'm, my mom is gonna watch this and be like, "But we trained you. What's going <laughs> yeah, on? Right. You're Nigerian." I can't, I can't believe you did. You, you don't know how to say. Are you, I feel like you are not. A, yeah. a, do you eat fufu? I do. I love do it. Eat I don't fufu? see, but I don't. I'm an okra soup type type person. Uh, okra, like that's me okra, all the time. Okra, all the time. Okay, good. I love a goosey soup. I'm just not the best at making it. Okay. And I don't want the random stuff them to know that anymore. So we're gonna. We what, just, what's we just start our own coalition. Niger oh Nigerians in the media. Do you live in LA? Yes, I do. Oh yeah, yeah. we about to. Oh, yeah. Nigerians in the media. I love Nim. it. Nim. Dude, I'm yeah. so proud of you, man. I love yeah. it. They were like, you're going to interview him, yeah. right? I'm yeah. like, yeah. yeah. Thank you thank so much. You so much. All right. Man. All right. Thank you. Give me your name again. Stacy Ike. Stacy. Yes. Stacy Ike. Okay. Nice to meet right. you, man.